kid, I'd take a trip every summer down to the Mississippi to visit my granny and her antebellum world. I read barefooted all day long, climbing trees, free as a song. One day I happened to catch myself a squirrel. Well, I stuffed him down in an old shoebox, pushed a couple of holes in the top. When Sunday came, I snuck him into church. I was sitting way in the back of the very last pew, showing him to my good buddy Hugh when the squirrel got loose and went totally berserk. What happened next is hard to tell. Some thought it was heaven and others thought it was hell. But the fact that something was among us was plain to see. As the choir sang, I surrender all. The squirrel ran up hard through its coverall. Hard leaped to his feet and said, Fuck, got a hold on me. The squirrel went to church in a first of righteous church in a sleepy little town of Pascula. It was a fight for survival that broke out. They were jumping pews and shouting hallelujah. Well, hard in the aisles, dancing and screaming. Some thought he had religion, others thought he had a demon. And hard thought he had a weed eater loose in his fruit of the loom. He fell to his knees to plead and beg, and the squirrel ran out of his breeches leg, unobserved to the other side of the room. All the way down to the amen pew, where Santa's sister burned the better than you, who've been watching the commotion with sir distant glee. Should've seen the look in her eyes when that squirrel jumped her garters and crossed her thighs. She took to her feet and said, Lord have mercy, something got a hold on me. Squirrel made laughs in her dress and she began to cry and confess to the sins that would make a safe for blood to shame. She told her the gospel that the church decision, but the thing that got the most attention was when she talked about her blood life and started naming names. And the first self to church in the sleepy little town of Pascagoula. Fight for survival, that broke out in revival. They were jumping pews and shouting hallelujah. Well, Sam Dickens and the pastor got saved, $25,000 got raised, and 50 volunteers for missions in the Congo on the spot. And even without an invitation, there were at least 500 rededications. We all got rebaptized, whether we needed it or not. Now you heard the Bible story, I guess, how he parted the waters for Moses to pass. All the miracles God brought to this old world. But the one I'll remember to my dying day is how he put the church back on the narrow way with a half-crazed Mississippi squirrel. Squirrel went berserk in the first self-righteous church. And that sleepy little town of Pasadena is fighting for survival. That broke out in revival. They were jumping pews and shouting hallelujah. With the surf and the self church. In that sleepy little town of Pasadena for survival. That broke out in revival. They were jumping pews and shouting.